Hey guys, it's CypherX, and I want to show you guys what we did yesterday. We worked in the garden a little bit yesterday, and we got blueberries. Yeah, we're going to try blueberries again. If you guys don't know, but uh, maybe a year ago we tried blueberries, and they, and they just died. Like, it was just a sad, fail attempt. But yeah, we're going to try blueberries again, as you can see. And we figured we might put them in pots and put fertilizer so we can keep them separate from the rest of the ground. Because blueberries like acidic soil or something like that. Well, we also decided to put cages around around the uh, the tomatoes here. Oh, and um, last recording, or two recordings ago, I think I actually called this a mango tree. When in fact it's a papaya tree. So, sorry. I might clear up some confusion there. <laughs> sorry guys. I don't know why I get those two confused all the time. We weeded out some stuff, and we're going to leave this here to dry out so we can use as compost. Um, we moved the pots down, and we transferred the plumerias into the bigger pots. If you guys don't know, oh, I don't know if you guys saw it all, but we had the little black pot right there. These little black pots over here. And we had them up on the rock wall. Like, I think right there and over there. With, the, with these plumerias in them. Well, we decided to transfer them into the bigger pots. Just, I don't know, I don't, really, don't know why. And in these little tiny pots, we're going to put cucumbers and beans or something like that in there. And we're going to have a huge trellis come all the way over and stuff like that. It's going to be pretty epic. Well, here's another thing that I really want to show you guys about. Look at, look at this Hawaiian chili pepper tree. Look at this thing. It's freaking huge compared to this one that you guys saw already. Look at this one. Gigantic. This is, We got this at Lowe's, and they had big ones there. Look at that thing. Hawaiian chili peppers, they, they grow so fast. Like, these are probably going to be done by the end of the week. Maybe. Um, here are the watermelons. What we're going to do is we're going to weed out this whole bed, and then we're going to fill most of it up with lettuce. And we're going to put more uh, peppers in around here. Like, I think we're going to put one there, and another one maybe here. And then one here, and one here. We're just going to spread out a little bit. And uh, we're we're a big vine, we're like a viney plant, like, fanboy or something. I don't, forget that. We like big, big plants. So we're going to put the squashes up here. We got two uh, feeder lines right there. And we're going to put a squash right there, and a squash over here. Where is it? It's over here. There, there it is. It's all covered with dirt. We're gonna put a squash there and squash there. I think we're just gonna put uh, probably the zucchinis. Look at this, guys. This is really epic. This is my first ever fused fused tomato leaf. And what it means when fused, it means or not not tomato leaf, fused tomato flower. And what that means is that this will grow either one big flower or two flowers that are like Siamese twins. They're like still connected. And that means that the tomato will be like twice as big. It, it's going to be pretty cool. So yeah, we um we got we got these these uh folding trellis. What is it? They fold out to like a fan shape like fans and we're gonna put them back here for the we're gonna put them back here for the blackberries. Yeah. I think you guys were noticing the watermelons down here. We're just letting them rot out over here so we can use them as compost and fertilizer. And right over here where we have strawberries. They have fungus all over them so we're just gonna let them rot out and die. Use as fertilizer. The fungus won't spread after it's all dead. I know that from experience. But yeah, um, the blackberry flowers are coming in good. Okay, so uh, we leave on Wednesday, and I finally figured out a way to upload and download and do stuff without being in Wi-Fi, because I previously somehow switched it so that I could only do less stuff when I was in Wi-Fi, but I 
I was able to switch it back so I can do that. So I will be able to upload videos while I'm in Oregon. And I do plan on I do plan on uh, doing some pretty cool things there. So I hope you I, I hope you guys will like it. And also I hope you guys like this. So like, fave, subscribe. Like, fave, subscribe and uh, comment. I love the comments guys. Thank you. See you guys later. Bye bye.